Since the launch of the iPhone 15 Pro and Pro Max, both phones have been receiving attention due to reports of overheating problems faced by users. Despite utilizing Apple's cutting-edge 3NM, a 17 Pro chipset in both models, even this powerful processor, falls short in preventing overheating during resource gaming or tasks. This is primarily because Apple has not yet implemented heat dissipation solutions in their flagship models in the year 2023. However, there is a rumor surrounding the iPhone 16 that suggests Apple is actively working on a graphene thermal system to address these overheating concerns. While Apple has attributed the issue to optimized software and released a software fix, it's clear that without a cooling solution software updates can only do so much. Hence this rumored cooling system could prove to be quite beneficial. Previously, there were speculations about Apple exploring the integration of vapor cooling into iPhones. Now, according to ex-user Kasutemis Rumor, it seems that the company is focused on developing a thermal system for the iPhone 16 series as a solution for overheating issues. Additionally, they are also considering incorporating a metal shell around the battery for support. It is not uncommon for smartphone brands to use graphene films to dissipate heat, with Google also joining the bandwagon with its latest Pixel 8 and 8 Pro models. But it only did a little for the overheating, therefore, the metal shell surrounding the battery on iPhone 16 may actually be true. While we will have to wait another year to see whether Apple uses this graphene thermal system on the iPhone 16 series, considering how the iPhone 15 Pro series is getting continuously criticized for overheating, Apple will certainly look for ways to overcome this issue. So, what do you guys think about this thermal issue on the iPhone 15 series? If you're already facing the same, then let us know it down below in the comment section, and for more updates you can check out our channel. See you in the next one. Peace out.